211 passenger in most dense configuration. For sure, you could choose a double class or mono class, depends on the airline, as usual. The cabin is very flexible. You have different suppliers of seats. Uh, but the, then more seats, then more cash. Uh, the airplane is targeted for the most demanded niche. For sure, it was uh, a little bit damaged after the COVID situation. But mid range, in the future, we expect to return its popularity. And our forecast that it keep the same um, potential for the growth, especially taking consideration that MC21 is a bigger than 320 and very close to 321. Uh, and our forecast for this niche from 130 up to 220 seats in this niche, it will demand about 17, 18,000 aircraft in the next uh, 18, 20 years. Uh, why MC21 is good? Because of the first, because of the brilliant aerodynamic, which comes from the old Russian aerodynamic school, with the high aspect ratio wind, which is made by composite. It's look a little bit narrow, and you could remark the airplane in the air. Uh, the aspect ratio is the difference between the lens and the cord. It gives you a huge impact, positive impact on aerodynamic. Then we have an option engines of Pratt Whitney air turbofan, the same like using on 320 series, or Russian made Perm PD14 with a similar thrust of 14,000 uh, tons. Uh, with uh, PD-14, <coughs> airplane names 310, and uh, 300 Sprat Whitney. PD-14 is installed on this airplane. It shows very well performances while it flew uh, to Dubai, non-stop five hours flight, uh, with the fuel consumption of similar that Pratt Whitney provide. And then we used the up-to-date uh, systems of the airplane, especially in the cabin. Cabin is very protective to the pilots because it helps pilot to fly. Uh, Russia is very famous also in flight control system and many know-hows were integrated in MC-21 and protect the pilots from the mistakes. And plus we, we have the uh, side stick with the full uh, feedback. It means you will show when you touch one side stick, another one is going also. And this allowed two pilots to coordinate the actions. When you have passive side sticks, uh, the co-pilot doesn't feel what is doing by captain and vice versa. Here, you know what do your uh, colleague in the cockpit. You could switch off or connect. The connection is fully electrical. Uh, we had a we have the Yasa team working for uh, certification, future certi certification of MC21, and their pilots especially acknowledge this connection, this uh, side stick. Plus, we have an excellent comfort. Because of the width of the fuselage, it's let's say a little bit wide body, narrow but wide body, because we are living in uh, our impressions of the, our mind. It was specially designed to increase the perception of the fresh air, more light and more width. You feel that you are sitting not in the narrow body, you sit in the let's say small wide body, but it's narrow. We have, uh, we have extended overhead bins, you will see. It allows you to increase in the number of in-cabin baggage uh, approximately on 50% because it's optimized to use the space inside because it's allowed to put uh, uh, the baggage on sideways like that. And you 
increase the efficiency of the space inside the uh, bins. Plus, we have only one. We have in mid-range the improved in-cabin pressure of the equivalent uh, 1,800 meters, which gives you more health for passengers and less time for the uh, staff. The composite materials, we used different ones, um, and this is the key why we were able to make such high spec ratio wind. We make a green field in our Ulyanovsk city, where we put the most, the latest technologies of producing the composite. We use uh, uh, vacuum infusion technology, which we believe gives a lot of advantages to the uh, airplane. The main task as of today is to finalize the, to get the Russian certificate and continue to get the EAS certificate in the future. Uh, Pratt Whitney engines already certified by Russian and by EASA. Russian made engine certified by Russian authority. Currently we have four aircraft, four flying test aircraft and two test aircraft for ground tests, plus one aircraft who flew here with the Russian engine. On our factory in Irkutsk city, we start to produce aircraft for the first uh, serial deliveries. For the first company, first operator will be Russia, that's part of the Aeroflot group. They already visit the factory and make an intermediate check of the produ producing the, of manufacturing the airplane. Is that a 300 or a 310? Uh, now it's 300, okay. because, so Russia will, the, will 300. Yeah, because yeah. the deliveries will start early, then we yeah. will get the Russian certificate for 310. Okay. So Russia but they will ordered take also 310. Yeah. Russia will take 300s. 300s, and then later on, yeah. 310. Okay. Who, who, who is your first customer for, the, three, for the 310? It's Aeroflot and Red Wings. Red Wings. Both. And we have an order of 35 aircraft with 310, with per engine, and from Russi from Aeroflot, and six aircraft from Red Wings.